Hey up, Bengal Bharta here. Mashed aubergine, spicy version, Punjabi style, very, very tasty. Not many ingredients required. I'll put a list of the ingredients on the screen so you can see. Um, what we do is we wash the aubergines first, pat them dry. Uh, the skewer is required later on. Uh, these are the list of the ingredients basically. And what we're going to do is we're going to coat the aubergine with a little bit of oil. Prick them first, obviously, because what will happen is they will explode if you don't prick them. Um, you can grill these now. What I like to do is I like to do old fashioned way, like my mum style, is over a gas flame. So use the skewer so you don't burn your fingers. And what we're going to do is we're trying to char the skin uh, equally all the way around. Uh, this will give the aubergine a nice little smoky flavor. Uh, what we'll do is once they're all both charred, you leave them on a plate to the side, let them cool down before you attempt to peel. Uh, then once they've cooled down, <clears throat> you can peel them. Easy, simple, it just comes off. Mash them up, uh, use a masher, I'm using a fork because that's how I roll. Uh, basically then leave that to a side, get a pan, a couple of tablespoons of oil, caramelize those onions, add the chilies in now or anytime if you want the chopped chilies, they're optional anyway. Um, one clove of garlic chopped, I add them about a couple of minutes before the end. Once the onions are caramelized, I add the tomatoes, fry them off for three minutes, add the spices, turn the heat down, add the spices and the salt, and then cook them off for about a minute and then add the aubergine. Stir-fry. No water required, no curry base required. It's quite a simple, simple dish. You can have it with anything. I actually have mine on a toasted bagel. They're absolutely gorgeous. And um, serve them, enjoy them, have them with rice, have them with chapatis, have them with pranthe, have them with bhature, anything you like. Just enjoy. Bye-bye.